Left-handed pitcher Kirk Kudrecki has made the most of each opportunity on the mound for Indiana State during his four years as a Sycamore. The six-foot, four-inch native of Dyer, Indiana, Kudrecki has been the Sunday starter this season after spending the previous three years as a key reliever out of the bullpen. Kudrecki has the ninth-best career earned run average in school history of 341. He has a 10 and 7 career record in 74 appearances and 15 starts going into today's game. He ranks fifth all-time in most appearances and in lowest opponent batting average at 245. During his junior campaign, Kudrecki posted the third best single season earned run average of 157 in 29 appearances. The honorable mention, all Missouri Valley Conference selection in 2013, Kudrecki is the son of Pamela and Donald Kudrecki. Ladies and gentlemen, number 26, right-handed pitcher, Kurt Kudrecki. Despite injuries, Tyler Browning has been a short reliever for the Sycamores during his four-year career at Indiana State. Browning had an outstanding freshman campaign with 10 saves out of the bullpen, which is the third most saves in a single season in school history. The 5'11", Mount Carmel, Illinois native, had 15 appearances as a redshirt sophomore in 2012, and up that mark to 17 appearances in 2013. The senior made three appearances this season before the injury bug bit again and his Sycamore career ended. Browning won three games as a reliever, but not any may be as memorable as being the winning pitcher in the final game at Minnesota in 2013. A sport management major already in graduate school and a second team All-Missouri Conference selection in 2010. Browning is the son of Beth and Roger Browning. Ladies and gentlemen, number 16 right-handed relief pitcher, Tyler Brown. Conway is another Sycamore who has overcome injuries to play an important role with the team throughout his four years at Indiana State. The six foot three inch outfielder from Hillsboro, Missouri has started 44 games during his career. He played in 42 games as a junior, posting a career best season batting average of 236 with 25 hits, including four doubles, a triple, and a home run. His junior campaign also saw him go three for three at the plate against nationally ranked Mercer and Austin Peay a three-sport athlete in high school and a graduate with a degree in criminology, Conway is the son of Helen and Bill Conway. Ladies and gentlemen, number 13, outfielder, Owen Conway. Josh Dove has spent the past two seasons at Indiana State after a highly successful career at Lincoln Trail College. The six foot two inch right handed pitcher from Terre Haute, Indiana and South High School has made 42 appearances as a Sycamore and was your winning pitcher Saturday. He has a record of six wins and one loss with a 260 earned run average. Two of his most memorable outings came this season, pitching a career high four innings at Southern Illinois as he stopped a, a Saluki rally and earned the victory. He also picked up his fifth career save and third this season earlier this week at Ball State. Dove is the son of Lisa and Rusty Dove. Ladies and gentlemen, number 38, right-handed pitcher, Josh Dove. When the Sycamores needed someone to leave the defense behind the plate, they looked to Mike Fitzgerald. The six-foot, one-inch Rochester, Illinois native quickly proved to be the man for the job. An All-American during his first two years at collegiate ball at Lincoln Land Community College. Fitzgerald has started 42 games this season and 45 games during his junior campaign. He enters today's game with a 286 career batting average with 21 doubles and six home runs. He had a career high of four hits in a game at Kinesis, including two doubles, and had a career high four runs batted in against Ohio State this season. Fitzgerald is the son of Leanne and Mike Fitzgerald. Ladies and gentlemen, number 22, catcher Mike Fitzgerald. Tyler Wampler has been a fixture at shortstop for Indiana State since he first donned the blue and white his freshman season. The six-foot senior from West Terre Haute, Indiana and West Vigo High School will be starting his 202nd game today, tying him for fifth on the Sycamore all-time list. Wampler has started all 45 games this season and holds a school record for career assists. 
He also ranks in the career top 10 for most times hit by a pitch, sacrifice hits, and fielding chances. He also became the 14th Sycamore with 700 career bats and the 6th with 200 career starts on Friday. His 184 assists in 2012 is the second best single season total. A second team All-Missouri Conference selection in 2012, Wampler is the son of Kim and Dave Wampler. Ladies and gentlemen, number three, shortstop, Tyler Wampler. Cody Zimmerman has been relied upon not only for his offense, but more importantly for his defense. The 5'9 inch third baseman has been an important part of a solid defensive infield. That has been one of the main reasons the Sycamores are where they are today. Zimmerman played his first two seasons at San Mateo Community College in California. The native of Newark, California has, two, has a 281 career batting average with 14 doubles, two triples, and one home run. The senior has had four hits in a game twice during his career both this season against Wichita State and UNC Wilmington. He also had a career high, three runs batted in in the Sycamore win over Indiana earlier this year. Zimmerman is the son of Charlene and Keith Zimmerman. Ladies and gentlemen, number eight, third baseman, Cody Zimmerman. And now ladies and gentlemen, please welcome John Sherman. Seniors. We have a message from Coach Hannes. For a group that has dealt with the instability of coaching changes during your time here, I thank you for the stability you've provided to the Indiana State Baseball Program. We will share great memories of your time here, and I will remember walking up to the quiet and reserved Kirk Kudrecki to make sure he still had a pulse and watching him attempt to play hacky sack. Spotting Mike Fitzgerald, who knows someone on every team that we play, functioning as our team ambassador. Seeing Owen Conway in his cowboy boots and belt buckle every day. <laughs> Questioning Josh Dove about hiding his candy bars from me on road trips and always hearing, ain't nothing but a peanut. <laughs> Observing Tyler Wampler's southern hospitality toward umpires in New Orleans. <laughs> Watching Tyler Browning emerge as the team director of extracurricular activities. <laughs> pushing Cody Zimmerman's off button so he would stop talking, <laughs> although his cartwheel on the mound during the infield pop-up Friday night was a close second. All humor aside, what I will remember most is an exceptional group of young men that will be greatly missed, but always a part of the Sycamore family, from head coach Mitch Hannes. Ladies and gentlemen, the class of 2013 for Indiana State Baseball. 